Okay, repairing my Explorer that got broken. Um, where is it? There it is there. You can see that the it snapped right in front of the V-tail. So <clears throat> how I'm going to do this is put a sleeve inside the fuselage. This I made on the outside of the fuselage, just in front of the join, the brake. Uh, release film, etc. the usual way. Cut a slot in it. So now it's springy, so we can feed inside the hole of the fuselage at the rear. Let's go this way. So it feeds inside there. And then I'll do it the other way into the front of the fuselage over there. The reason I don't do it the other way around, put it into that side first. And then this side is because I don't know is if when putting this on that I'm just going to push the sleeve up the fuselage and not have any overlap on there. So I put it in here first. That and the fact that there is a, a bulkhead. There's a bulkhead just there. Now what are these rods for? The rods are to keep that they're greased. They've got, they've got Vaseline on them. Petroleum jelly. And they are... Um, grease to uh, prevent epoxy uh, excess epoxy closing the holes which should be a oopsies, major downer um, and also to make sure that there is enough um, clearance because I'm increasing the wall thickness there and the, the push rods ran along the wall of the fuselage so that's increasing the wall thickness by moving them in a bit opening them out a bit opening the hole size diameter out a bit <clears throat> so when this goes in let me just get that sized up correctly that one goes that way okay so that goes in there it goes in there and I'll put that onto the onto the fuselage then I'll push these through because by then all of the all of the epoxy that's in there would have, if there is going to be excess amounts of it, will have squeezed where it's going to squeeze, and I'll then I'll push these through far enough so that it will leave a clear run for the push rods. Hope that's clarified that bit. The spaces you'll notice I've got little spaces on here. Where are you? Little spaces there. Um, when I pushed these onto the tail so the sorry the rear end of the fuselage one side here of the, the push rod I keep doing that sorry uh, this control horn was fouling on the one rod and wasn't on the other so and i needed them to be equidistant off the fuselage for when i go to align with the center panel that way okay I think that should be pretty clear as mud. Clear as mud, I'll put that in there. That feeds in to there like that. That goes on there. Align it all up, little clamp on the front. Do some aligning and just let it set. That should be it. 